were all paintings of um, outdoor scenes kind of staged or being reenacted indoors in people's bedrooms. The rooms I'm using in these pieces are made up of um, different rooms that I've experienced in my life and they're all kind of collaged together into um, these separate spaces which are almost like dream spaces. Well, it kind of stems from the, the Maurice Sendak storybook, Where the Wild Things Are, about the kid who gets sent to his room and trees sprout from the ground. But I'm looking at older children and their bedrooms as reflections of their headspace. pay attention to the way people stand and carry their feet. A lot of these um, models look a little bit nervous or off balance in some way. Which is, yeah. Usually the animals I use um, reference some sort of book I had when I was little or a certain story from my childhood. So in this case, um, these sparrows are like um, kind of like moral instructors. Like from surreal little drawings that make you want to imagine more. <laughs> They're not taken at face value. They make you think about being creative, they make you think about being imaginative and about being somebody that you're not. And I think that really speaks to people. It's the product of five months of work, so I hope that this hard work does inspire other people.